tough merino wool zip front hooded cardigan. This is now just back in stock. We are offering this at a sale price of $149.94. This sweater would normally be about $192, so you're getting it for 20% off today, saving you about $42. Color-wise, we're offering this gorgeous army green. Next up, and I'm gonna, I'm gonna do it this way because I want you to be able to see each one of them. The black is the new color in this sweater. Isn't that stunning? Love how beautiful and dressy that can be. Next up, we have the soft gray. Next to that is your dark chocolate. Oh my gosh, that is so rich and so beautiful. Again, a color that you'll love and enjoy wearing. Excuse me for reaching in front, but now I'm gonna grab this beautiful parsnip and a, a classic kind of natural tone, but it's marled, so it has a lot of depth in the color as well. And then the last two, I'm gonna switch sides and do it this way. We have the gorgeous uh, wine. And then finally, we offer the navy choice in this sweater, a 351067, also customer top rated, over 45 five-star reviews on this beautiful sweater. And I have the pleasure of welcoming back Barry Cullen, who is part of the family that brings to us the Aaron Craft sweaters. Welcome back in. Always a pleasure. Hello, good to be back. How are you keeping? Well, I'm so glad that we have another um, long sweater to offer our customers today. This one is beautiful. Lots to talk about here. And this one really is uh, one that I, I would consider, especially at this time of the year, to be something that you could really be using as your outerwear. Um, it's got a very dense knitted pattern on it. It's got a, an internal collar inside the hood as well. Um, it really has all the elements of a coat, but in uh, a knitted iron, iron style fabric. Well, it is so beautiful. And you know what's really cool about this one? This really does like speak to that full like outerwear piece. Uh, Barry, it has more of the stadium jacket detailing, which I think makes it even more versatile in how this can be worn. So I'd love to go through all of the different elements on this, starting sure. with the fact that this does offer you that kind of funnel neck um, type of detailing, but it also has a self hood attached to it. So it's kind of a twofer with the hood. It, it, that's exactly as I would describe it. It's, it's a twofer because you like you have you have this beautiful the double layer of material in that as well. So that hood will stand that the collar will stand proud on its own. It's not something that's going to be floppy or flimsy. It can stand away from your skin if you don't like something touching your touching your skin. Even though it's 100% merino wool and it'll feel perfectly comfortable. Not everyone likes their skin their skin being touched by their clothes. But because of that extra layer of material, which is a lot, just, just the amount of work that goes into just even getting this two layers of material and also attaching the hood around the same seam it really is just a, a tribute to the to the to the workmanship that goes into this and also when, once you kind of come down here you can see it's a little bit it's a little bit more of a modern take on on this style of knitwear while you still have the fisherman's cable that's visible here these are these stitches here are there we call these the tide stitch so if you've ever been, been out on a beach when the tide has just gone out you see those those kind of diagonal kind of parallel lines going out that are left by the waves as they as they recede. That's what, what the inspiration of this is. But what it does is they actually bunch together a little bit and as you can there's a little bit of stretch when you when you stretch like that. But it creates a denser fabric, which means this is something that can while it still will regulate your body temperature, it it has more of the feel of something that's a little bit more rugged and a little bit more outer wary. Right. Something that can be worn kind of as it, it re replace your coat coming into spring. As you are walking the grounds of the moors um, around your ca your castle, as it were, right? <laughs> this is that kind of sweater so, that's every, going to Everybody, feel everybody really good. here has a castle. <laughs> <laughs> um, but it's, you know, it's comfortable. I love that it's a little bit longer. You know, we would call this stadium length so that if you are wearing this and you're at that sporting event sitting on the, be on the bleacher, you have that, uh, you know, sweater covering your tush. 
And this was also equipped with a two-way zipper. So Barry, yeah. if you are, you know, driving, you get in the car, you sit down, you can release that zipper, which I think is another thing that makes this every, really versatile. Every, every, we were so conscious of, of, of that. When you make something a little bit longer, you really yeah. want to make sure that it's comfortable to have that clearance. So not only if you don't want to use the two-sided zipper, we've also put in side slits on it as well. Yeah. Um, so it really, it really is ma making it as, 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 as practical as possible while also making it as, as functional as possible. Well, and to get it today at under $150 is a really good deal. Normally, this would be almost $200. Uh, $42 off with three, four easy pays of $37.48. This is what I picture as I'm looking at um, this beautiful model walking with the Irish wolfhounds around the property. Oh, that, was I a, mean, that was a stunning day. Oh, gorgeous. How wonderful. Um, and here's the thing, it's the perfect sweater on those days when, you know, it's not bitterly cold, you don't need a heavier jacket. When the wind is whipping like it has been the last couple of days here mm -hmm. in Pennsylvania, you can throw that hood up. And if not, then the hood just acts as a wonderful balance on the shoulders. I love a hoodie um, because I think it helps to balance your hips and it's just very flattering. When, when and, it's down, it can be worn almost as a shawl color. Sure, yeah, sure. And it's got functional pockets built into it, plus all of the rich history of the traditional Aaron Craft stitches in this as well. And as I turn to the back again, those stitches continue all the way around the back of this beautiful sweater. And we always think it's very important, particularly in the back of a garment, to have a central vertical piece going down. And you can see that these fishermen's cables coming down as a centerpiece. It's great to draw the eye down. It's great for elongating the mm -hmm. silhouettes. But you still have to the left and right, you still have those tied stitches that are sure. giving you that kind of, the, the kind of, it's, it's, it's almost like it, it feels fitted without being fitted. Um, it, it, it'll adapt to, to, to your body when you put it on and, and it will just kind of it, it will hit all the points where it's supposed to hit when you're trying when you're when you're wearing it very so, flattering um, I think the silhouette yes. is very flattering that's, exa that's exactly the word I was mm -hmm. looking for <laughs> comes right in through the waistline plenty of room I could put even a, another sweater underneath if I wanted to I love that Jody mm -hmm. has this on with a cute pair of jeans it could be a boot and a legging situation a three five one zero six seven I want to go through all the color choices one more time and encourage you to place your order, take advantage of the sale price. And I think what I'll do is smush this way so that you can see, look at the navy. How beautiful is that? It's rich, saturated navy. There are six dozen remaining in that color. Next up is the wine. So pretty, only six dozen remaining in wine. Next up is parsnips, 125 available there. This chocolate is, oh my gosh, that is so gorgeous and so rich. 100 only in the chocolate. The new color is black, and that's, you know, it's, it's kind of surprising because here, uh, Barry, everything is always made in black first, and then we typically add other colors. In Ireland, not so much. The black is, you know, kind of a rarity, so love that we have that in the black. 100 remaining. And then here is the gray, that soft gray. And there's about 150 of those. I'm wearing the army green. I took this right off the, the rack. There's 300 of these. And I love that some of them have, like the green, a little marled detail and others are more of the solid. Yeah, so the, you've got a selection of marls and mm -hmm. uh, solid colors in this. So the army green uh, particularly is, it has two different colors of, uh, 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 two, two ends going into every thread. Right. One is, is it a slightly darker, one is slightly lighter. And really what that does, it helps you with um, create, it emphasizes the natural variation that you will see in a natural fiber. Like it, because wool, it, it doesn't take dye exactly like an acrylic wood mm -hmm. in a very, very solid color. And, and really putting the marl in, it just helps emphasize that natural variation. It's so pretty. And all of the beautiful stitches um, gives you the highs and lows, the peaks and valleys, the the shadow that's created within each of the rows of it's the... A three, it's a three-dimensional uh, it, fabric, really. It is really. three-dimensional, and it really... Make, it's just almost like the oxidation that we talk about in our Connemara marble jewelry that has the different dark, you know, uh, elements that really help to bring things forward. And that's where you get to see that dimension and all of those beautiful stitches. The yarns are all merino wool, a natural 
fiber that helps to regulate your temperature so that you're comfortably covered and cool when you need to be and yet can be very warm and insulating when you need that extra coverage, right? When you need it, when there's a little nip in the air, as we say. Correct. And what is the temperature right now? Um, I think here it's probably, well, I suppose, I don't know what it is in Fahrenheit. It's probably in the, in the uh, probably about 50 degrees, I would say. Maybe, oh, okay. Maybe so high, it's about the, high, it's, high, four, high 40s. It's about the same as it is here then. So you're yeah. uh, in, in that same season, the season where we're anticipating mm. and looking forward to the weather changing. But for right now, yeah. we need this jacket. We need this coat um, to get in and out of buildings and go back and forth to work. Yeah, it, 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 it's it's it's. Marina, what is the ideal thing just for that transitional period when you just want to throw something on? Um, it's not going to it's not going to overpower you. It's it's just something that you, it's something light and fashionable that you want to. As you said, as you even if, if you're working in a big development or going from building to building, it, it it's it's cold enough that you can just want something that you can really just throw on. It's very easy to wear. And it really, this is the perfect time of year for it. This is a good go-to, um, especially if you spend a lot of time driving. And if you're a commuter, this is the perfect jacket. Um, and also, you, you know, the other coldest place on the planet, Barry, is in the frozen food section of the grocery store. <laughs> so this is the Agreed. perfect <laughs> coat, you know, that when you're going shopping, you don't have to worry about being freezed out of that section of the grocery store. Right, Jody? Um, this is perfect. And yet it's not too heavy. So you don't feel like, you know, you're carrying around yeah. um, a big, heavy, bulky coat. A 351067. In the last minute or so, I'd love to go through the colors and then get you to talk about the symbolism of the stitches one more time for us. So parsnip is what uh, Jody is wearing. There's about five dozen of those. We have the navy, four dozen there. Wine, four dozen. There's Jody's parsnip. Here's the chocolate brown, three dozen available there. Black, which is brand new today, five dozen and gray, soft gray, 100. And then finally, the army green that I'm wearing, there are only 200 available. A thousand spoken for in the show. Really quick, talk stitches for us. Sure. So I think, um, as, as I mentioned, this style of knitwear originated in these fishing villages. So there's a lot of the, 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 the symbolism is themed around that community. Like for instance, these uh, fishermen's cables that you see going on either side of the placket there, these would have uh, represent. This is what cable dish was actually named after, and these represent the ropes that, that the fishermen used to draw in their nets to raise their sails, etc. And really, they became good luck charms for the for the fishermen to return with a bountiful catch. Um, as I mentioned, this is uh, this is an intricate. It's really it's 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 two fishermen's cables um, mirror image. We call it a shell stitch, which is where you kind of have one cable going into another, almost like a little optical illusion. And really, what it is, it's 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 just another like um, another thing that you would see around this, around the seashore. And then, of course, this is what I mentioned was the tide stitch, which which these 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 horizontal uh, lines that you see as the tide goes out from a, on, a, on a beautiful flat um, beach. Um, and it re it really is all to kind of as just little nods to what the people saw around in their in their environment when they were making the style of knitwear. Love it. Well, continue in the process of placing your order and take advantage of the sale price. And Barry will be back a little bit later on. Um, so you get to take a break. We get to take a look, though, at some of the beautiful scenery at the Slane Cat.